What's going on guys? I'm here with Caitlin uh, from ROI Renovations Hi, and she's going to take us through our third update video of what's going on with Jonathan's house in Mundelein. Come on in. Here we go. So I think last time you guys were here, basically all that was kind of done was painting of the kitchen cabinets, hardware install, um, new appliances. Uh, we kind of had to work backwards here because we had such a long lead time on our flooring, which is pretty important in terms of when you're installing your baseboard and your shoe, uh, with new painting and so forth. Um, Check out that flooring. So, yeah, we uh, got the flooring in last Tuesday, got that fully installed, got all our trim installed. Um, kind of walking through. So this kitchen is really looking stellar. I love it. And then you got this new light fixture here too. That really it pops, I feel like. Yeah, it's getting there. Yeah, especially at nighttime. I don't know if you can see <clears throat> the detail on the ceiling for the light fixture. Oh yeah. Shows. Oh yeah. yeah. A cool little design. Yep. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay, and then we got the living room. This looks so much bigger. I love this. Yeah. So the uh, reason I think it looks a lot bigger is the way the flooring was originally ran was uh, the planks were ran this way, um, which I did in the rest of the house. However, in this room, since this is kind of like your main walk-in area, I wanted to run them. Uh, horizontally, so to speak, and it really just does wonders in terms of making the space feel larger and more open. Um, and the walls are painted too, right? I think you said first coat on those? First coat, yep, first yep. coat. Uh, we still got to paint all, all of the trim, but uh, yeah, we got the first coat on it. Excellent. Um, got all of the, the baseboard and the shoe on. So a little tip that, that I like is, you know, this high profiled uh, baseboard, I think looks really sleek and nice. And the best thing about it is when you need, you know, your shoe to cover any waviness in the floor, any imperfections, um, since you have this uh, square flat profile, um, instead of buying uh, a shoe molding separately, um, which, costs if you buy it separately about a buckle in your foot. Uh -huh. um, what I do is I buy extra casing and run it through a table saw and I can get about 60 feet for I think it's like $3.75. Nice! Yeah, That's so a store. Huge savings in that regard. You get that same profile that you have with, with the base and it just looks really sharp. Yeah, yeah. That's um, fantastic. It looks awesome. Yeah. And it also saves a lot of labor time because you don't have this detailed uh, baseboard where you have to cope your inside corners or anything like that. You can just run butt joints and, and sure. get stuff really quickly. Yeah, so, that's fantastic. Uh, currently working on this uh, accent wall. I had some shiplap left over from another project, so we threw that out. We're going to do a dark paint here, some soffit lighting, um, some cedar shelving, and I'm excited. Yeah, it'll be beautiful. Yeah. Now I heard a drill just now. We got something else going on in the crawl yeah, space? So, a uh, big plumbing day. Some plumber that was here before got creative <laughs> and uh, decided to just cut a hole in the main sewer line in the crawl space. Whoops. And drop all of our, our bathroom and kitchen waste lines in there, which no bueno. Um, so we've got guys down there right now. They're cutting out about a four foot section of the main sewer line, putting in a, a new one. And then, and then dropping all of our uh, baselines properly yeah. to it so we don't have sewer gas. Just leaking. Fantastic. And I think that, that section was kind of uh, starting to rust, rust yeah, away anyway. Yeah. Galvanized, yep. uh, so. Sweet. Yeah. So pretty basic in here other than a huge pile of insulation. Because, Score. Yeah. The insulation upstairs is just matted down to about this, but it's basically pointless. So we're going to get about a, a, a 10 inch uh, R value, so things will stay nice and toasty in the, in the winter and not hot in the summer. And I think we got new light fixtures in the hallway too. Yes, yep. new light fixtures. Um, I don't know if you remember, but there were some nasty built in, there were flies, they were yeah. gross. So <laughs> we tore those out. Yeah. Um, got these fixtures. Sweet. For 46 bucks for a two pack of Menards. All right, there yeah. you go. And they look, and they look high end. And look how good this flooring is. Look, looks, guys. This is fantastic. Yeah. Um, I had uh, another.
another plumber here yesterday because we are basically, as you can see, fully gutting this bathroom. Oh, wow. Um, I've got a really sleek uh, black shower trim kit that he wrapped in the new valve for. Uh, we set the tub yesterday. Geometry was not on our side. Ah. So we had to cut part of the, the, the door jam out. Oh, which okay. I generally would not recommend, but this is a 24 inch cell, or hollow core door. Um, so I'm not too concerned about the weight um, once yeah. we repair this, but it yeah. should be fine. Okay. It's things that we have to do sometimes. It's um, a sharp looking tub. Yes, that's a, a Kohler Elmbrook top. Nice. Use it in all my renovations. So, uh, I was actually just about to finish pulling out this window casing because we are going to replace that and I feel like Oh, wallpaper. Beautiful. Any other fun surprise under here? wallpaper sure you get the set. everything pull. else looks like it's in good shape sweet yeah we're gonna pull this out new lighting uh tile yep, it's kind of a surprise for john okay uh, yeah he's uh letting me kind of take the reins and has allowed me to surprise him with the final product sweet okay uh, hopefully you guys can catch that surprise in the final yeah final video. love it we'll have to do one more video once it's yes. over um what are you thinking as far as timeline here we will be done next week Sweet. You have to be. I'm going to Florida uh, <laughs> uh, the following Monday. So. Okay. <laughs> you have to be done. Awesome. Um, we're going to be painting all this white. We kind of considered leaving it the wood tone, but, you know, after we kind of got our flooring in and started painting it, it just... Mm -mm. Yeah, I think that'll look really sharp white. Yeah. And a new light sure. fixture here, too, in the dining room. Yeah, so the idea here, you know, putting this, this longer fixture here is somebody putting a, a dining table here. Excellent. Um, yeah. So. Yeah, um, all new floor registers. Got a nice oil rough runs just to kind of, again, a little bit more high end than just doing your standard one. Yeah, yeah. Um, it really, really makes it look sharp. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So that's about it for now. Okay. Um, and next time you guys see it, it should be all done. And that's it. Well, thanks for the video tour update. Um, this house is looking fantastic, and we're excited to uh, see the finished product. Thanks, guys. All right, have a good one.